Good morning everyone! This is Jerby, your Certified Aromatherapist. I am also the current country representative for the Alliance of International Aromatherapists and the founder of Alliance of the Philippine Aromatherapist. So for today, we will be discussing about Ilang Ilang. If you've been following me on this channel for quite a while, I'm sure you'd know how much I adore Ilang Ilang. And luckily for me, well, Ilang Ilang is abundant here in the Philippines. So it's not really surprising for me to find out there's an Ilang Ilang farm. Actually, there is. It's way up north of the Philippines in Aurora region. And this is their locally produced Ilang Ilang essential oil. Today, I will be comparing our locally produced Ilang Ilang oil with some of the international Ilang Ilang oils that I have in my collection. So if you're interested to get to know how it turns out, then please keep on watching. Alright, so here is the Ilang Ilang essential oil from EA Real Agro Farm. I have featured this producer a few weeks back and we were able to talk to Arwin Soriano, the farmer or the engineer who's processing this. If you haven't seen that video, I will link it up here. It's part of our APA livecast where we feature a local producer every month, ideally. Through our Facebook group so if you want to join that tribe I will put the link down below or search for Alliance of the Philippine Aromatherapists we try to provide free education for everyone because education is one of the pressing issues here in the Philippines with regard to our local aromatherapy industry is we lack education in terms of I guess accessible education in terms of the end users or even through the producers. So we wanted to support that through APA and we also wanted to focus our efforts on sustainability. So let us go back to EA Real's Ilang Ilang. I'm sure you've heard how Ilang Ilang can help lower blood pressure. It's really good to make you feel calm, ease away anxieties. Ilang Ilang is a very nice, fragrant, floral oil. It has a sweet note that everybody loves. It's usually added in the fragrance industry. In fact, I've heard that France has already um, IPO'd Ilang Ilang. And therefore, I think that is the reason why the perfumers or perfume companies would normally source out their Ilang Ilang from Europe instead of being from the Philippines. Although the Philippines is one of the I guess historical sources of Ilang Ilang and so is Elimi and so is some other plants. Um, and that is what we try to focus with in our live casts, in our free webinars at APA. Okay? So in this video, I'm sure you are as curious as I am to compare our local Ilang Ilang essential oil compared to some of the known international essential oil brands like Plant Therapy and Eden's Garden. I actually have multiple Ilang Ilangs because I love it so much. But these are also from different points of distillation. So we have Ilang Ilang Extra, which is the first run of distillation. We have Ilang Ilang One. This is from Eden's Garden. And it actually says in their label that this is Ilang Ilang One. Or I think it's in there. Yeah, it's here. And it's on their website. Um, these are all steam distilled. I'm not so sure for EA Real if it's steam distilled or hydro distilled. Sometimes the chemical constituents would vary depending on the processing or the distillation process. Okay? But let's just compare them as regards to the basis that they have the same plant source. That is Ilang Ilang. Okay, so we have Ilang Ilang Extra, which is the first cycle of distillation. Ilang Ilang One is the second. And we also have Ilang Ilang Complete, or the final round of distillation. Um, normally, there's Ilang Ilang One, there's Ilang Ilang Extra, Ilang Ilang One, Ilang Ilang Two, Ilang Ilang Three, and Ilang Ilang Complete. This is the end or final distillation process. And as expected, the aroma is not as rich or as sweet or as pungent or as strong as Ilang Ilang Extra. I think we've tried to compare this a few months back. I've tried to compare the Extra and the Complete. I personally prefer Extra because I love the strong, sweet smell of Ilang Ilang. However, I've met people who don't really like the strength of Ilang Ilang Extra and that's why they prefer Ilang Ilang Complete. 
For EA Real, they told me that this is their Ilang Ilang Complete. They used to distill Ilang Ilang Extra, but it's too strong that a lot of people are sort of turned off by it or put off by it. Okay? So let us try to sniff our way through these bottles. Actually, upon taking off the cap of Ilang Ilang Extra, you can take a slight whiff of the fragrance of Ilang Ilang. It's very different. I would assume this is hydro distilled, but I will confirm with Arwin for that. Let me just check it with him. All right, so we have everything down here. Okay. It smells very sweet and fragrant. This one as well, sometimes they say that Ilang Ilang 1 and Extra smells almost the same. Very, very similar. I think it's better if we like take the cap off and sniff it. This smells different. This smells more of that plant, plant type. While Okay. It's very, very different. This feels floral, but it doesn't smell as sweet. I feel that it lacks the sweetness that I'm used to as compared to this Ilang Ilang Extra. It has more of that sweeter, intoxicatingly sweet Ilang Ilang note that I love. I'm sure not everyone is like that. I'm sure some people prefer an Ilang Ilang that's more toned down but i really love the sweetness of it so i really love ilang ilang extra you may notice that this is a lot fewer than the rest of these um i think i purchased this out of curiosity but i still prefer ilang ilang extra the note is much different this is much more floral i feel that this smells a little more alcoholy it has that alcohol smell like the things you use for your room spray it almost smells like that so i'm not so sure why that is so this is the sweetest plant therapies ilang ilang extra this smells more like a plant i can i can almost smell leaves out of it i can almost smell petals and leaves out of it <laughs> So I, I don't know why, but I really can't smell the leaves from it. This is Ilang Ilang Complete, but it's very floral. It's not as sweet as Ilang Ilang. It has a little bit of that jasmine or some pagita dimension. It's very, very floral, but it lacks the sweetness that I'm used to. And I think that's normal with the Complete because um, normally... Ilang Ilang Extra would capture all the most volatile components of the distillation of the flower. So that's why all the sweetness is bottled up in your extra. And as you go along, as you progress to the distillation process, the final step would lack all of those volatile, really sweet um, notes of the Ilang Ilang. And it would smell plainly floral. Or in this case, I can smell the leaves out of it. So there you go. I've tried diffusing with this. Again, it doesn't have that sweetness. Although I can smell the floral tinge into it. I can smell... Um, you know, it adds a beautiful dimension of floral, but it lacks the sweetness that I am used to. So I guess that's all for today. If you have tried Arwin's or EA Real AgroFarms Ilang Ilang, don't forget to shoot them down below. If you've tried their hydrosol, I really love their hydrosol. It smells amazing. It's one of the sweetest smelling hydrosols I've ever tried and I really love formulating with it. Don't forget to follow us on our Facebook group at APA or Alliance of the Philippine Aromatherapists. I love to see you there. I put a lot of essential oil content there exclusively for that Facebook group as well. So if you want to follow us the group is actually monitored and by various certified aromatherapists here in the philippines who are already graduated or are on their way to graduation so it's one of the most well backed up 
aromatherapy groups here in the Philippines. By the way, we will be having our next APA live cast on the 19th of September and we will be giving away these 15 ml bottle of citronella oil. Again, these are locally produced plus 300 bottles of citronella hydrosol for everyone. So if you haven't registered for that yet, I will put it down below as well or check out our linky that's l-i-n-k-y dot ph slash a-p-a roma a-p-a roma or you can check a-p-a's instagram page and click the link on the bio we have listed all our events there you can just click each of the poster to sign up and join us in any of our free webinar so i hope to see you guys in any of our events and i'll see you on my next video bye